Be ready today. So one of my subscribers asked me, how did I get my dog so obedient? And so I want to give you a little um, taste as to how we've done that. Um, first of all, most dog breeds actually want to please. And so the first thing I did with these dogs is I treated them like children. <laughs> uh, I, I don't know if this is true, but canine um, trainers and, and PhDs indicate that dogs at their adulthood have the mental capacity of a two to three year old. And so I, so far in my experiences with dogs, I found that to be true. And so one of the things that I did to get them accustomed to going outside with us and going in the woods and, and the like is I took them with us. And if you notice here, while I'm sitting around this uh, so-called uh, so campfire, <laughs> or well, this campground, this makeshift campground in the back of my house, you notice that they have balls. Um, this is Big Guy's ball. Uh, and that is Baby Girl's ball. <laughs> and so one of the things that I've learned is you have to give your dog something to do. Uh, you don't want to have them out running around and just getting into all the mischief that they can. Let's go, come on. You have to give them something to do while in camp. And in this case, both of these dogs have significant uh, ball drive. And so what I've done is I've got them accustomed to having their balls. And so everywhere we go while we're camping, they have this ball with the exceptions of with the exception of going out um, hiking. In that case, I want them to center their attentions on me unless I tell them to go out and play. And so that's just one of the items that I'll be sharing with you in terms of getting uh, dogs accustomed to going out with you and being at a campsite. Uh, without running away or running amok. Another question came to me mentioning uh, from one of my videos, how did I get my doggies accustomed to running in the tent and, and going into tent on command? Well, the focus of my training was to get them accustomed or get them used to actually seeing the tent as part of our home. So when they see a tent and I'm in it, or my wife is in it, they know that that's home. And so what I've done is, uh, if you look at some of my previous videos, I put a tent on the deck. And every chance I get, I'm in the deck with them. And they know that when I say tent, they go to the tent. Again, they're with me. I'm not with them. And that's something that you can actually sh uh, teach your, uh, your doggy uh, to stay in a tent and not want to run out. And so th those, this, this is a short little video about what I've done with getting my dogs accustomed to being in the tent. Consistency and repetition is the key to this type of training. Tent. And there it is. They're so accustomed to going into the tent as home, they love it. It's, it's like their second home. To recap, go ahead if you can put a tent up in your backyard, go ahead and do it. Uh, if you can't, go ahead and put a tent 
in a room in your house. It doesn't have to be a eight person tent. It could be a two, three, four person tent. Bring your dogs in there. Allow them to see the tent. Allow them to go into the tent, go out of the tent and teach them that tent means exactly that. Let's go to the tent. Show them that it's a good place to be. And when you show them this uh, particular skill, don't necessarily be harsh on them if they have issues. Um, one thing you might want to do is if your dog is um, kind of tentative with going in, go into the tent, bring a treat, bring his or her favorite treat, call his or her name, and when you go in and he's tentative or she's tentative to go in, you tell him, hey, come here, uh, Fido, whatever. When he comes in, you can say tent, good dog, and you give him a treat. Another way is the opposite. You can have a treat in your hand and you're standing outside of the tent. And you take the treat, you smile or you do whatever your dog loves you to do. And you throw the treat inside the tent. And then when the dog goes into the tent, you say, tent, good dog, and you praise him up. That's another way you can do it. There are so many ways you can do this. This is uh, also similar to crate training. This will allow you to have a lot of fun with your dog, with your canine in a campground. And I'm not a professional, but I know what works for me. And hopefully this will work for you. Take care. God bless.